Welcome back, everyone, to your week three of the Draft League. So week two, uh, my opponent forfeited, so it's an instant 3-0 for me, uh, which is absolutely fantastic. But now it's time for the week three. As you saw on Wednesday, that uh, my little prep video, what we're up against. I have the, I have a plan in mind. I know how to beat this, and I'm ready for my opponents to just send in the invite. Uh, but here we go. So this is a team. Here we go. Ah. Okay, Ex exactly what I expected. I expected one, two... No Jodalgi, though. Oh, okay. So what has... Okay, so no Jodalgi. I don't know what the what to lead off with. So my Pelipper does kill one, can kill that. But I feel like Heracross is the best lead. Because Heracross... Um, if I can play Heracross correct, I can probably see what they're doing. Oh, I was not... Because I bought two Electric Tides, but... Probably my electric types aren't needed now. Okay, so this was not a, this was not a team I was expecting at all. Um, I'm kind of terrified to what what they could bring here. Obviously, I will say good luck, have fun. And if you don't know, a little bit a little bit of uh, lore, but my opponent is actually the person that has been coaching me through week one and a little bit of help for week two. So. It, this, 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 this will be, it's, it's like the master versus his apprentice. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm terrified to see what happens. But I feel like I can come out on top. So, Heracross, I don't see as many uses now. Um, so Heracross does beat, um, uh, the Greninja, does beat the Herac um, uh, not the Heracross, does beat the, um, can beat this boy here. But what does he leave? Raikou, he leaves off Raikou. So I think I knock off. I think I knock off first, see what it does. Um, get rid of any item that might be a little bit scary. Because he's probably going to go for a special attack. So it'll probably get me quite low or could kill. I don't outspeed him. So he could get the one up on me straight away. Which wouldn't be the best in my favor if he got up straight away. Um, especially as... I just have to be very, very careful of this thing. I can't have that thing have a beast boost. If that thing starts getting a beast boost, he will sweep my team. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see how we go. Um, if he switches, that'd be interesting. But I don't know what he'd switch into. Maybe he's Infernape because he's Infernape faster. But he, um, his Infernape would lose anything he switches into. He loses an item. I love. <laughs> I just realized the name. Please sub. That's right. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Oh my goodness. I have to love the name. We'll now just wait for our opponent to slowly make a move. Uh, the fact that it's taking so long is like super anxious. They're probably thinking to themselves how, what they could do. I don't know if they were happy about the team I brought. Or if they were a little bit terrified. I really thought they were in the Jigalgi. That's why I brought the Heracross. Because I was expecting... Um, I was generally expecting for them to very much like Toxic Spikes. Because Toxic Spikes ruins my team. But no Toxic on my side. It's been perfect. Um, as well as, honestly, if he switches out, that might be better because he could be protect. He could be expecting the protect here, because I don't. I don't think he knows I have protect. So he could be protect as uh, predicting the protect. So he'll switch out thinking he's safe. I get to knock off off, and flame orb activate. I mean, you only have to live one hit of anything. Close combat, bam, we're safe. It just it just depends on bot switch. Okay. So he, so he does, does get a little bit of damage off on me. That's smart. Infernape. Okay, so what does Infernape have? Life Orb. Okay, got rid of Life Orb. Um, see, Infernape's not really too good at all. I might have to just risk a facade. Though, I feel like if he Flare Blitzes me, I die. But I feel like if I risk a facade, um, because realistically, all this would do is probably I I have an answer to that. I can definitely beat that. I think a facade. Okay, so he's probably so probably next time, probably next time, um, he'll probably leave the same and probably try and um bolt switch. Meaning I could probably then use protect first off, protect the bolt switch, him stay in, and then I can facade whatever he bolt switches into. That probably be the um better play for next time. Flare Blitz. Okay, I thought so. I thought so. I mean, it gives me a free switch into this, and I 
I'm expecting a thunder punch, but I feel like I can live one. Yeah, I, I knew I could live. I knew I could live. Okay. So we are badly hurt. I'm guessing he's gonna send in his um, beast boost mod. Um, mainly because why wouldn't you? He could send in something else here. If he sends the Vaiku, I'm I can that's an easy switch. If he sends in one or two, that's an easy switch into my swamp pit. Um, if he sends in this, I can probably go into the Electros. Okay, I, I, I at least have a plan for game two. So if I can win this game, I have a good strat for game two. But we're one apiece, but I am... I'm technically also down a Pokemon just because 19. Only problem is his team is so fast. His team outspeeds my entire thing besides this Mega Swamp it. I knew, I knew he's going into that. Okay, so I can go into this then. Go into my Celesteel. Knock off. That's fine. Because I can go... I can... Though this... Though it's lower in um in the main, it's still probably my best option. If he goes into this for the flash buyout, that'd be so smart. But I don't think this thing is scarfed. That's the only thing. I don't think it's scarfed. Which would be an issue, because I feel like it's still going to outspeed it away. That still did... still did 30%. See, it's tough, because I want to hit the flamethrower. Like Muffin's video, I love it. I love it. I thought he was going to do that. Okay, I got to make sure this thing lives at all costs. So I can do... I can actually switch into Swamp It. Um, Mega... Probably stop him from Vault Switching. Mega Evolve. Unless he does a hard switch out. Because, um, Raikou shouldn't have any grass type moves, so get into this. Toxic? Oh my goodness. Missed the Toxic. Anything he switches in now is going to hurt. It's going It's going to hurt him so bad. Ah, uh, I thought so. So what is he going to send into? Because if he sends in the Greninja, I still got to hurt from, um, from that. If he sends in either of those two, probably will kill. Okay, so he does have Toxic. So his Volt Switch, Toxic, but he has to switch out. There's no way he can hit me. So at least I get free damage off something. And I don't believe this thing is Scarfed. I won't risk my Swamp Pit either way, but I don't think this thing is Scarfed. Um, I'm guessing he's going to probably go into Greninja. Greninja would probably be my prediction. But I saw Earthquake just because Earthquake hits a lot of them badly as well as if it switches in that i'll be surprised but i at least heard it pretty badly um with pelipper still alive as well it means i can set up the rain if needed um and i still have these two in the back um full 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 of health ready to our uh, fight okay so at least i'm getting damage on something so it's not an entire waste of a turn Though my Pokemon are looking... Probably not looking too hot. Okay. Duh, he's taking, he's taking a bloody long time. I don't like this. I don't like how they take... Um, he's taking so long. Um, okay. Hit you. Oh, my goodness. The, the tension. The tension right now. Please, do something. Um... Okay, so if he does go into the Katana, I might have to, I don't think I can really go back into this. He'll probably predict it. So I'll probably go into my Electros, take a hit, then fight back. If he goes into Greninja, that's still Electros easy. If he goes into Heat Train, I'll be surprised, that's for sure. But maybe he's going for the Burn, because that would probably render this thing pretty much useless. Low Pony would also be very, very, very interesting. Um, but he could um, always Mega Evolve and then Fake Out. I think, or even protect to try and waste the uh, rain turns. Because I think that's the biggest thing. Waste, wasting rain. Um, because in reality, it, whenever, I, whenever I send out Pelipper next, that'll be when Pelipper dies. So either he will either he will protect a switch and then try and attack me, or he'll kill my Pelipper and I get a free switch. Thought so. Now, it just be, do I outspeed? Do I risk it? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I think I have... I think I have to... 
I don't think I outspeed here. Fuck, they did still so much. They still did so much. Okay, he got the he got the attack up. Oh, oh wrong one, wrong one. Okay. So he will either try and attack me with Leaf Blade, which would do nothing. This would actually be a perfect opportunity to see if he's scarfed or not. So it's it's not it's not completely um thrown out just yet because he'll probably try and switch. Um, if I was him, I'd probably go into the heat train. But with that with that injured now, I don't think he wouldn't be able to send it in against an attack at all. He's I, actually know what he's probably doing. He's probably trying to calc whether or not um hitting me now will kill me. He's not scarfed. He's not scarfed. That's the, that's the best information I could ever hear. He's not scarfed. Okay. The, probably one of the biggest threats is now down. Because this still... Okay. Oh my goodness. I can probably try and leech seed this. But... Um... I don't know what he'd do. I'd probably try and leech seed. Unless I want to keep this thing alive, but it can't really do much against any of these at this health. So if this goes down, I can at least go into Pelipper. And then I can probably Scald, because you'll probably uh, expect me to switch out into um, Swamp It. Or I could always Hurricane, one of the two. Ah, Stealth Rocks. So with the seed, with the seed up, I can now... I can, I can protect against a little bit more health back. I thought, thought so. Um, I wonder. Oh, that could be really risky. I mean, Pelipper might die from the rocks anyway. I might just have to go for it. Because if, if Pelipper dies from the rocks, yeah. Fine thought. Wait, it didn't set up. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh my goodness, I'm an actual idiot. Oh. Okay, my team doesn't outspeed anymore. Fuck. Okay, team doesn't outspeed. Ah, I can't believe I was so dumb. I can't believe it was so dumb. I don't know why I thought Drizzle would activate. Um, oh my goodness. Uh, okay. Bit bit worrisome now. Like I will I will I will take some damage and kill it. So I, uh, I, don't, I don't know what I don't know what I was thinking because I have defog in my other Pokemon, so I could have just let this thing die, go into this defog, and then switch out into, and then switch back into this when he sets up the rocks next. Oh, that would have been so much smarter. Therefore, at least I got a little bit more rain, so rain would have been bam, bam, kill those two. He'll probably go into this now. I see no reason why not to go into this. I'm glad I have this at least 53. But I, I see no reason why he wouldn't go into this. Ah, so dumb. I'm so dumb. And I got, I got, and I got, and I got rid of. I should have kept rain dance on this thing. I had rain dance last, uh, the week before that on this. I should have kept rain dance. If I kept rain dance, if he switched, I would have just gone the, the rain again. Therefore, it wouldn't have mattered. Ah. Uh... Gosh darn it. Okay. I don't know what my opponent's trying to do now. I think he's just... I, Because if I was in his position, he's up He's up against me. Three of his Pokemon are still 100%. I'd just go into Greninja at this point. Be safe. 
At least I know that thing's not Scarf. Therefore, I will always outspeed it. I think I gotta go into this. Ah. But that's what you have. Interesting. Interesting. So that has grass rock. Okay, I can actually probably just... Uh, I'll actually... I'll get rid of the, uh, the rocks right now. Um... This will probably kill. This will probably kill. But I can at least parting shot into this. So it has skull as its last move. So this forces the switch. And it switches into this dead. This dead. And only possibility is the low pony. It's the only actual reasonable possibility to switch into. Okay, let's free switch into that. Um... I could probably try and go into the valley. Mega evolves. Fake out. Perfect. So then I can go into this and I can air slash. So unless it has fire punch, I should be fine. Because both of those Pokemon can't do anything to my um my swamp it. Oh my goodness, we actually bought this back. We somehow bought this back. I have no idea how we did it, but... I mean, it's not over just yet. This thing can still probably kill me. It's bloody powerful. But I'm, I'm hoping... I'm hoping he either switches. I mean, granted, if he switches, I can pretty much let this thing... I can pretty much let this thing die. Or maybe not. Oh my goodness. So I thunder punch it that much. I think I have to let this thing go. Okay, so if I let this thing go, it now just becomes it becomes a one it becomes a it becomes a one v one v three. Surely this thing doesn't have a grass move, does it? Surely not. I mean, if it does, it's pretty much GG's because I think everything else outspeeds me. I just hope it doesn't do as much. Dizzy Punch wouldn't be... Return would be deadly. Granted, I do have a lot of bulk. I did I did put a lot of HP and bulk into this. Uh... I'm hoping he I'm hoping he switches to for the flame body. Granted, if I got the flame body on me, I'd I'd be furious. Cause that can't do anything. Yeah, it's just a low pony. It's just a low pony that kills. I think he might be expecting Aqua Jet. So whatever this thing cause so it's Thunder Punch doesn't affect me, fake out. I'm guessing he's ex I'm guess okay. I'm not. I'm not. Sure, I'm not too entirely sure what it's going to do. Oh my goodness! This is so tense. Heatran. I think he's going for the flame body. Oh no! He's going for the fake out. He's going for the fake out. The double fake out. Then oh, it's so smart. He's going for fake out to do bigger damage on me. Oh my goodness. I think it's all over. I think Skull kills. I think Skull kills. Oh, so close! So close. I think I have. I think I have a good plan. So I think. I think the plan. I. 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 I think the plan. First off and foremost, I protect with the Heracross. Um, only thing is, I don't think, I don't think I live anything, I don't think I live anything that, um, the uh, Infernate does. So, I, I think, uh. Honestly, I, I feel like if, 
I feel like if the um Yeah, I feel like if the if he sends out Heatran, I just close combat straight away. Oh my goodness. If only if I if I was scarfed, it'd be so much better because I could just scarf kill. I'd probably outspeed most things as well. Cause that's that's just life orb. Okay. Um what is he gonna do here? Once again, taking his time to really get into my head. <sighs> so close. That was, that was so smart doing the fake out. I didn't realize Scald was going to do 16. I think that was the downside, the Scald doing 16. Or, like, if, if I had a, a lower roll with the uh, close combat, maybe I could have lived a little bit more. I just played that so poorly with Pelipper. I th I thought I could I thought I could um. Okay, so I know that's not scarf. Therefore, I can if if Swamp it's in, he switches that in. I can kill that. Because I'll, I'll outspeed it. So I I know that for a fact that I can outspeed a non-scarfed uh thing, because it only goes up to uh three four eight. Therefore, I can two shot that. Honestly, if I had if I had stayed in and two shot it, I would have been in a much better position. Therefore, because I would have known I had speed, I just didn't know I was going to have speed. Ah. Uh. I think I just gotta go close to combat here. Flavors will still probably flavors will yeah kill. Yeah, I thought so. So I'm expecting Thunder Punch now. So I go, yeah, I'm expecting Thunder Punch. Thunder Punch. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. Look, honestly, whatever he switches in is gonna take big damage. Uh, he's taunting me now. He he's gone into my head. Okay, okay. I should I should have stayed in. I mean, it's not over just yet. He's probably he'll probably go into Greninja. I feel like Greninja just makes the most sense. Yeah, I thought so. I outspeed though. Unless I don't. Maybe I don't outspeed. Because I don't know if this thing is scarfed or not. Oh my goodness, he's he's destroying me right now. I think this is a loss. I think this is a loss. He's gone into my head. Ay, ay, ay. So he's probably predicting parting shot, but yeah, I thought so. So I'm guessing protect. Yep. I mean, he still has to switch out. So he'll either switch out into this he starts to switch out to something or he lets this thing die. So 
already if he switches out into is going to take big big damage honestly for for honestly i think he'd probably sacrifice his greninja he lets the greninja go um if i well, at least if i was him i let the greninja go Aye, aye, aye. See, problem is now his his uh Veneri can outspeed me. I think. So I think I lose. I think I lose Swampert to Veneri anyway. So I, I probably need either one of these two alive for the Veneri. And now he's talking about who to sack because all his Pokemon are so good. I, th I think this is a loss. But yeah, no, if I was him, I'd probably sack the Greninja. Because, like, no point having the water type. Oh, that's frustrating. That's really frustrating. The only issue was, like, w I don't know what else could really take a close combat um, that. Because if I wanted to Pelipper. Yeah, okay. Um, a critical hit would have been nice. Granted, he's probably predicting me to go... Uh, is he predicting me to go into... He's probably predicting me to either go Celesteel or the Pelipper. I feel like he's probably predicting Pelipper to set the rain again, but I don't know. He's been very crafty this entire game. The crit! Oh, that would have done nothing if it wasn't a crit. Like, when I need a crit, it doesn't give it to me. But when he needs a crit... If like gives it to him straight away. Ay, ay, ay. Um. Got so. If I get some le if I get the Lee Seed up. It could work out better with the Lee Seed up. Granted, I still I feel like I still lose this though. Ah uh, shit. Oh, rain is ending too fast. That's my issue. Rain is ending way too fast. So, so Valley probably goes down here. The worst thing about it, I have to, I have to go into. I, he's he's locked. He's locked me down. Nah, I can't win. I play that so poorly. Nah, because he's locked me down. Because even, even if I... Nah, he's, yeah, he's, he's locked me down to get rid of Defog. Yeah, he's locked me down. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, because now Fake Out will probably kill. I'm just waiting for him to Volt Switch. Because he, all he has to do is Volt Switch into Low Punny. Yeah. Now, nah, Volt Switch into Low Punny.
Fuck. I should just put the timer on. Um, I don't know what I could have could have gotten. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have sacked the Heracross. I feel like sacking the Heracross was like my biggest mistake. But I couldn't really send in anything else for the close combat. Maybe that. Then get a free switch into this Hurricane. Uh, probably him predicting the switch. Low pony. I thought so. I thought that was like the only answer. Thought so. Yeah, it was rain over as well in like two turns. It was pretty much GG's from the- okay. I pretty much lost. I play that so poorly. And that was that was just uh that was that was just that was just rude. That was just rude. That was that there was no need for that. There was no need for that. Yeah. Anyway it ends. Ah uh, yeah yeah. Alright, last battle. Last battle. I'm gonna go hair across. Oh, I played so poorly. I played that so poorly. You know what? I'm not wasting time anymore. He can hurry up. We're, we're putting the thing. Oh, motherfucker. Um, actually, this would, was that works out better. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, so whatever he switches into is going to take big, big damage. So like whatever like unless he switches into a steel type, it's not gonna look well to him. Um so this is definitely fake out. It's definitely fake out. We're going to that for the fake out. Mega evolve. Fake out. Thought so. Predicted. So 105. Okay. S slash. Okay. S slash. Uh, we're in a, such a better position. Like who comes in? We'll go Electros. Scold is very unfortunate. And 
then we'll thunder. We'll thunder whatever comes in. We'll thunder again. And then we will... We'll flamethrower. At least I'm getting damage. I'm getting damage off on him. I'm hoping he switches into... Oh, I was, I was hoping he switched into... What's with these crits, man? Now, I could actually go into this. Problem is he poisoned me, though. I'm hoping for the vault. I think I can live a vault switch. Could I live a vault switch? I live a vault switch. Okay, whatever he sends in is dying. Because I, I still live a toxic. So whatever he sends in dies. I'm, I'm still hoping for the... I'm still hoping for subscribe. Oh my goodness. Honestly, if I was him, I would have protected. But I'm not gonna let him get- I'm not gonna let him get the kill. Knock off. Perfect. Go into this. Hurricane. Fucking no crit this time. Dead. Okay. Okay. We're in such a better position. Such a better position. He won't go into that because he knows he knows I will just um earth I will just send in my swamp it. I think he'll go this. Honestly, if he switches into this, that's fine. Mega low pony, thought so. But we're gonna scald. These critical hit, man. I can't be handling these critical hits. These critical hits are killing me at the moment. I don't think I would have lived, but... Okay. 100% dead. So basically, every time I fought that good ninja, it was always a roll. It was always a roll. Problem is with rain now at, at a standstill, I need to make sure I can live. I think I can probably I need that rain up as long as possible. I'm hoping like after it gets to the two to five turns, I still have five turns. Because that's I think all I need. Low pony comes in. Fake out. Predicted. Leaf seed. Okay. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. I think he's going to go into one of these two and sack him. Because he probably needs that for this. Because low pony is still low in health, so I can still send this in. And Savali can probably get sacked. e -trend? Thought so. So I'm now 203 speed, therefore all everything outspeeds me now. Unfortunate. But just the way the cookie crumbles. Infernape. This is going to do massive damage. Kills. Boop. I'm expecting fake out. Thunder punch. Lost 30. Oh my goodness, we actually won. And to 
seal the deal. No, no screw ups. Uh, uh, we won the last battle. Oh, why could I do that in the first two battles? I screwed up so much game two, but you know what? GG's to my opponent. Um, they played really well. At least I got some type of win out of it. So congrats to them. And I guess um, I will say preference before the video ends, before you click away, uh, the um, draft league will be put on hold just for about a month, um, just because complications uh, with the leader and all that. But it will be it will be back. We will be week four. Week four will just be much later. But that's everything for me. We'll see you in the next draft league, and I will I will improve. I will improve. See you guys later.